Yo, what it is? They like hicks. No, no gang signs. Not about that. Um. So we're outside. Beautiful day in Southern Florida. You know. Oh wait, it's, it's too low. Okay then. Beautiful day in Southern Florida, and uh, I got a shoe that not many people you know know about. It's not that popular in the game, at least from what I know. Um. I mean, I've already played ball in them, and, uh, yeah, super bright, like that, like real loud, so everybody can hear them. I want to do something like that, but I don't want to wake up your mom or the lady that. Just do a pretty good turn. Yeah, all right, all right. Um, yeah. Hello? Pump it up. Going up. Size 9. Uh, little details. Uh, came with, came with some keychains. Little pump thing right there. Pump it. You got the hexalite, which it opens up. Hexalite, there you go. Comes in the Reebok paper, and here they are, the deep brown pumps, nice shoe, I've always wanted these, um, hold up a sec, nice review, see ya. Key Browns. No, first of all, got the pump. Can't go wrong with the pump. And you got a little release valve thing. I prefer that uh, the old one that they used to have, the OG pair, it had it like right here or something like that. Nice sure. Reebok basketball. And then it says Hexalite TM. So, I mean, I don't know what hexalite is. You know what hexalite is? No. If you could tell us what hexalite means. I think it's the material. Yeah, I, I don't know, but, I mean, if you guys could tell us, please do. I've always wondered what that meant. Uh, on the inside. Oh. We have just noticed that hexalite I is... Knew. Let me read it. The Hexlite honeycomb design spreads shock over a large area than EVA or poly whatever. As a result, it combines cushioning and lightweight for superb performance. Hexalite. It's, right, it's here. right there. And I didn't bother to look at it. Stop laughing. Um, yeah, okay. I can't see the sun's in my eye. But yeah, that's how bad he wanted to know. He didn't bother to read the thing that said Hexalite. Yeah, that's cute. Thank you. Um, so, it's... Whole upper is leather. You got tumbered leather, and then you got the regular leather. Um, right here, actually, it feels really high quality. I'm not sure if it's it. I think it's real. It's a really nice feel. And then the tumbered leather is just mad soft. The creasing. Reebok took care of the creasing. Jordan, Nike. You guys really need to get this material because when you step on the shoe like that, certain ridges of the shoe crease instead of just a whole big line right here. So that's a plus. Um, you got the little thing right here, the lines. This is what really got me into the shoe, this line right here. I really like that. Um, I grew up watching wrestling, and uh, John Cena had these. And I was like, oh my god, I've always wanted a pair. And back in fifth grade, I got a pair, but they weren't pumps. But I mean, whatever, I finally got pumps a long ass time later. The sole right here is actually made of kind of like a rubber spongy material, like Nerf gun. Some, like, it's like that. As you can see it's like creasing. And you got a little white right here. You got the black midsole. With some white ridges. 
got the white right here with the orange and you got the orange bottom sole with the orange black and white bottom and you got the hex light honeycomb the hex -light right there honeycomb right there we know what it means now i know what it means um yeah if you look at it it's it's all squishy no i'm just kidding it's, it's, it's yeah it's cool um some leather like i said right here here you got the white leather right here inside the sock line i don't know if you can see reebok anymore but there you go there one thing let me know you guys if you ever get reebok pumps or any reeboks make sure to put tape over if you want to keep the the reebok or whatever kind of logo it has down there my other pair it's already faded because i played basketball in like for an hour and they've already faded but this one's still managed to say it and my other shoes actually they say real now so it's r-e-e-l on my other on my other insole and uh it's got the cushion black cushioning it's really padded these are like really nice basketball shoes very padded um the tongue again it's it's just patent pending we're not gonna get it we're not gonna zoom in that and um yeah here they are Reebok pumps should i do an auction you show the shoe box and the paper and all that i did i already showed the paper in the box you showed the tag and all that yeah uh, i have experience i've been doing this for a while should i show how they look like on feet yeah you gotta be like me this is what they look like on feet obviously right <clears throat> And now I'm going to show you what these I like that part. Now I'm going to show you what these look like on feet. You know what's weird about the camera, bro? Hey, you can start. So here's what they look like on feet. Move back one. What? Move back. Hey, so, so here's wait, what... Move a little bit. Like, like an inch forward. Alright, that's fair. So here's what... Alright, wait. Okay, go. So here is what they look like on feet. I don't like how I said that. So here's what they look like on feet. Very nice black and white. You can't go wrong with black and white. But, I mean, I only use this to play basketball. Yeah. It's bad cushion, so it's freaking huge. Um, yeah, um, No, the YouTube production of Dilla Kicks. Know what I'm saying? We don't get we can well, we talk it for you guys, we can jerk for you guys, we can Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe.